Yo guys, what is going on? Bobby here and today we finally have another video for you guys. So it's been about 9-10 days since I've last made a video and I feel like I owe you guys at least a little bit of an explanation as to why. So a lot of you guys saw my community post and a lot of you guys also saw my tweet. Um, I haven't really been feeling that well over the last couple weeks, three weeks, maybe even a month. Um, I don't really know what's wrong. and I don't really know exactly why, but I just wasn't feeling motivated at all to do anything. Had nothing to do with Brawl Stars because I was still playing Brawl, but I wasn't streaming at all or even close to as much as what I usually do. I haven't been making any videos. Um, I haven't been playing too, too much, and it's affected us as well the rest of my life. You know, a lot of other things I just don't really want to do, and I just been have been in a pretty poor and sour mood. Um, yesterday, though, I did feel a lot better. I streamed. I had a really good scrim with my teammates, um, and I was just generally happy throughout the day. And today, again, I'm feeling good. So hopefully that little funk is over in that little phase because it put me in a place in which I really didn't like and I don't want to be in ever again. So I hope you guys don't mind the few days that I had to take off. Um, it did definitely help to take a little bit of a break. And we're going to be back at it with daily videos once again. So what we're going to be doing today is playing B. Now, I know I'm a little bit late to the punch. I don't know if many other um, YouTubers have made this uh, video yet, but B is without a doubt by far the number one brawler in Brawl Stars right now, if you have her second star power. So what makes B so strong is A, her 3k shot, B, how, B for B, B, how far she can shoot it, and C, her star power. So her star power is called Honeycoat. B escapes certain defeat with one health and gains a momentary shield. The power is available again after she is defeated. So every time she comes back to life, she basically has an extra life type of uh, star power where she, for a second or like a second and a half, will just have one HP. She can run away. She can do whatever she wants. And it's really, really, really good. And we're going to display that here in Brawl Ball. So we're going to get into some games. We're going to be playing with SSG is greater than IX. And Bobby, I need you, who is Ali, for those of you who know her. So let's hop into the games and let's get into it. Okay, so here we go into the first game, and we're going to be facing Shelly, Primo, and Jesse. So something about B that people think is that she's a sniper, but she really isn't. You can kind of just walk up to people and auto-aim. So you guys saw that's an auto-aim shot. I uh, aimed that one. Going to try and aim that. Not going to hit it. So with her super, it's not really the most useful super in the world. It's okay. Um, the goal is basically just to get people stunned. doesn't really matter how you use it or when, to be honest. Uh, we're just gonna be chilling over here right now, gonna be able to hit this Primo. And from here, you know, you can just auto aim your shots. It's gonna be 100% uh, success rate, gonna go for that Shelly, gonna be able to hit that shot. And with the 3K damage, we're able to take her out. She's not able to defend, and that's gonna give us the first goal. So you guys can see, really, really good. So two days ago, I had B at 200 cups, and I've only played her in scrims, but I'm very convinced that she's the best brawler in the game right now. So I decided to push her on ladder. Probably gonna go for a rank 35. You guys are gonna see Bobby, I need you, AKA Ali, getting the double kill and then missing the, the shot to go in the net. Um, this Primo is just going to walk right towards us, but there's literally nothing he can do. going to give him the ball, just walk right through him. Uh, Shelly's going to come up over here. We're going to get her slowed down. Ali's going to give me the ball over there. We have our 3k shot, so I don't really want to shoot that at a turret, so we're going to be able to hit that Shelly over there. Hit that Jesse. And we still have our like extra life type of thing. Oh, we're going to miss that over there, but we're still going to get the kill. Going to hit that 3k shot, and most people don't expect it when it doesn't hit them first. So the fact that you can get uh, your, your shot charged off of somebody and then you guys saw like that Shelly just walked forward and didn't do anything is pretty cool. So we're going to just walk forward here. Because of the 1 HP, we're able to stay alive for an additional second. And then we walked up and did the one tile kind of glitch type of thing that I taught you guys in the Brawl Ball video where you can just walk up and kind of shoot through them. Um, that's something that's very, very broken about B and undervalued for sure. So that's going to be the first game. Went really, really well. We're going to hop into the second one now, and we're going to continue showing you guys how strong B is, specifically in Brawl Ball. Okay, so here we go into the next game, and we're going to be going up against Rosa, Crow, and Primo. So that actually reminds me to talk about counters, um, and there are very few brawlers that counter B, but surprisingly, Crow is probably the number one counter. So what makes B so strong is her one HP thing. So as you guys can see right here, one HP, I can kind of just stand still, do whatever, and then shoot it in because of that shield. But if Crow hits you, the poison is gonna keep hitting you and it's basically gonna fully counter that shield. So it's actually really, really, really strong. Unfortunately, Crow isn't really the greatest brawler in the meta right now. So you guys aren't gonna see too much of Crow um, anywhere. 
but um, it definitely is a fantastic, fantastic counter. So we're just going to run through that game really easily. Uh, while we hop into MM and go into the next game, we're going to keep talking. So what are some other really good counters? So Daryl and Carl are probably my two favorite counters. And the way to stop B is trying to basically just get right in front of her face and just try and do as much damage as possible. Carl and Daryl, obviously, you can spin slash roll and get right, right on top of them and do really, really well. Another great counter is Nita, and Nita, just because of the bear, she can only charge her 3k shots B off of, like, another brawler. It can't be a turret, it can't be an Ike, a safe, it can't be the robots. The only thing you can charge it off of is brawlers, so that's why um, Nita's really good. The bear is lethal, and then Tara, I guess, if you get your pull, but... That's kind of against every brawler if you get a Tara pull. It's pretty lethal. So we're not going to include Tara. So those are the, the four main ones. And if Crow gets into the meta, then I definitely expect Crow to be the number one counter. But unfortunately, Crow's just not good enough right now to be the main counter. So I would suggest just playing Carl um, or Daryl if you think you're going to be going up against a B. We're going to stay away over here. Gonna try and hit that shot. Going to be able to hit it. Going to weaken that Tara and be able to pick up the kill. Going to go for the 3k shot. Barely going to miss it. But you guys can see how much damage we're doing over here, how much control we have because of B, and we're completely staying away. And anytime we even get close, we kind of just stay alive with that 1k HP shot, or sorry, that uh, the 1 HP uh, star power. So we're going to hit a 3k shot right here on the Shelly. Again, shooting at unexpected people is definitely a strat. Ali just team wiped. Going to do a little bit of a spin and put it in. We finally used our star power, but it doesn't matter. We're getting a new life since we're respawning, so we're just going to get it right back. Um gonna go through over here now the interesting thing about b is that she can be a lane but see she can also be a mid she's very 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 versatile which is not usually something you get within brawl stars i don't think she's too good in solo modes now she is really good in lone star and she is really good in uh what was it i forgot what the other one was um i think it was duo showdown but solo showdown and takedown i definitely wouldn't use her but outside of that you can basically use her in all the other 3v3 modes she's pretty good everywhere she's probably the best goalie in the game or slash best defending brawler along with like gene or shelly let's see if we can hit that shot just a lot of damage a lot of spam you can slow people down with your super so the defending is really really strong I'm gonna be able to pick up that kill over there and we're just gonna walk forward so hopefully i can just walk forward and use my one hp star power Gonna go for the trick shot. Oh, I could have hit it except I missed the trick shot. So at least this game is gonna be a little bit longer and it's not gonna be like a 30 second game like the other two. But after this one, we're probably gonna hop into Gem and I'm gonna show you how to use her as a mid. It's also very important to know how to push her on multiple different uh, modes. Gonna walk forward over here. Gonna take that one shot. Gonna continue. I have my 3K shot. Oh, I went for the Shelly, but I somehow hit the M's. But that is going to wrap up the game. Five seconds left. Four, three. Going to be able to kill that Tara. Two seconds. One. And that is going to be game. So that's three Brawl Ball games. Three pretty easy wins. I believe we got started the first two. I don't know. To be honest, I'm not really paying attention to that. But let's hop into the next game. We're going to be playing some gem. And I'm going to show you guys how to use her in gem. So here we go into the game. And I'm going to be the mid here. So again, B has some really, really good range. You can help pinch lanes really, really easily. So we're going to start off just by shooting this lane. Not going to hit anything, but it's fine. We definitely outrange their mid, so that's obviously really, really good. Going to take a shot over here. Our crow is dead. Going to try and hit their Leon. It's not going to work out. We're just going to rush right for this M's, and we're going to be able to get the kill. We're going to take the long way back. Actually, we're going to jump pad since there's a Leon in there, and we have our 3K shot. So we're just going to jump in. Oh, we're going to miss our 3K shot, though. Going to get that hit. Going to get another one gonna go for this our ooh, we had our star power working and that saved us uh kept us alive but unfortunately we go down because another brawler jumped in so unfortunately unlike a gene we can't just pull the gems towards us so we're gonna have to work our way back into this or get a kill and then go and get the gems but we have our 3k shot right now so that's really really good we're gonna want to use that on the m's Ali's going to jump in. We're going to try and hit that more. We're not going to be able to, but we're going to be able to get that kill, which is fine. Um, trying to get our 3k shot and then hide in a bush. Oh, didn't know that Leon had the gems. Going to be able to pick up that kill. Unfortunately, we did use our star power, though. Our lanes aren't doing the greatest job so far. Oh, we're going to be able to pick up that kill, though. Oh, almost was able to pick that up. Okay, we have our 3k shot charged though, so we're just going to go, oh, the Mortis is going to try and jump on us. 
Gonna miss that Dorike shot. That was definitely huge. Gonna hit our get our charge. Gonna hit that shot. Gonna stun the Mort. Gonna be able to pick up the kill. Again, just trying to charge our 3k shot. There it is. Gonna hit the M's. Just gonna make her go down. And we're doing really, really good at this point. Gonna go for the Leon. Gonna get that hit. Gonna just have to hit that. Oh, don't need to anyways. The M's is close. We're gonna take our time to get this gem. But there we go. We got 10 gems right now. So we're gonna move back. Um, again, charging our 3k. Gonna go for the Mort. Gonna miss it. Gonna be able to pick up the kill. Leon's gonna jump in. Oh no. That wasn't a Leon. The Leon was... Oh no. Oh no. We got snuck on. No way. Guys, I think we just threw. I think we just threw. Oh, we hit her for the 1k. Oh my god. We just needed one more shot. Oh my god. I, I Okay, that was my bad. I threw. But you guys pick... You guys know how to do it anyways outside of that very last part. Just don't do that. <laughs> you guys are gonna be okay, but you guys saw what to do pinching the lanes always helping trying to charge your 3k shot hiding and then getting a 100% guaranteed hit We're gonna move on to one more mode so we, so we can show you guys how to play bounty It's gonna be a little bit hard because it's gonna be snake But we're gonna use a bow and try and show you guys how to use it So it's gonna hop into it one more game. Hopefully we don't throw this one as well Let's get into it and show you what happens. So here we go into our game And it's gonna be again a little bit tough because it's all grass, but we're gonna be able to figure it out with B so we're going to just take some shots, try and uh, charge our shot. Oh, and there we go. Really good start. So I believe they're somewhere around here. We do have the bow. Always use a bow on this map, by the way, if you guys are playing. That's without question. You guys should know that already. So Ali's going to move up the left. We always want to follow the bow, even though I do believe there's going to be people behind us soon. I'm going to go here anyways. Oh. I'm going to use that. Oh, 68 health. We almost picked up the kill over there. That would have been insane. That would have showed you guys the true strength of B. I mean, that should show you guys the true strength of B, to be honest, though. Just going to move up over here. Take some shots. Hopefully, we don't get snuck up on. And just as I say that, there is a Shelly. We're able to pick up a kill. And yeah, we're shooting some shots over here. Going to stun so the Shelly gets hit by those mines. Going to go for the 3K shot. Going to hit it. Gonna go for this bow. Probably shouldn't have shot that. I'm just gonna keep spraying until you get the 3k shot and that's when you wanna save it. We're gonna slow down this bow. I kinda trapped myself over here. That definitely wasn't the strat. Shelly is coming from the back. So this is gonna be pretty interesting over here. We're gonna be able to pick up that kill. We're also gonna be able to get this bow. So there we go, two kills, which is going to give us back a comfortable lead. 25 seconds left. We have all the grass broken, so we know just about where they all are. Oh, that's going to put me down, actually. So it's only a five-star game at the moment, but we should have this one in the bag. It's going to super this Shelly. Nowhere for her to go. Going to get that tap. She's going to super me right into a wall. Doesn't matter. Going to get that kill on the Rosa. Stood still a little bit for the BM. And that is going to end it. So I don't think we got star player there. We actually did. Never mind. Cross that. But that's kind of how you use a B in bounty. It's a little bit more difficult uh, on Snake. But you definitely just kind of want to keep your distance. Charge your 3k shots. And kind of the same strat as gem. But anyways, that's going to be the video. I hope you guys enjoy. And I hope you guys agree with my opinion. Because I definitely do think B with the star power is the best brawler in the game. Let me know down below if you guys disagree. And what you guys think and why for which is the best brawler in the game but that's gonna be it uh again i apologize for not posting at all in the last nine to ten days but i really didn't need that time off it helped me out a lot and i am gonna be posting daily or almost daily as much as i possibly can so stick around for that but that's gonna be it for today i will catch you guys hopefully tomorrow but i'll see you guys whenever peace